Okay, guys. Look what I found today. Don't want to get too much in the way. So, for those of you that don't know me, I like toys. And I went out and bought a new Umarex Steel Storm. Put this crazy flashlight laser on it. $12 off eBay. A couple bucks more. Little red dot. Anyways, these things are sick. Single auto or select fire. Six round bursts. Man, I'm going to go through this this summer after I do some more playing with it. But trust me, I've had so much fun. There are so many videos on these. I mean, if you want something for around, well, I'd say under just under 100 bucks. Seen them for $67 up to 98 average. And then some of them get high priced. But Umarek Steel Storm. Great toy. Can't wait. But today... We're talking about what I got to go with it. 20 bucks. Umarex air guns, fast spinning action, 80 targets, 20 deer, 20 elk, 20 hog, 20 squirrel, heavy steel construction, compact storage. So, hey, it looked a lot bigger on the on the vi or on the page that I bought it. Anyway, we'll open her up. I did open this earlier. It had a ton of tape holding it, sticky stuff, and I did bust it loose. Just for this so I could show easier and not have to stop and go and stop and go. <laughs> I got these cool cool targets. They're hard to see. I gotta get a better light in here. But uh some extra red dots. Some squirrels, boars, there's elk, deer. That's actually really heavy feeling made. Like you're gonna be able to shoot at them a while and I don't know. You got a really strong BB gun. They'll shred them up. If you got an older one, they might last a little bit. Comes with three pieces. Your base. Actually, it feels really pretty heavy duty for what it is. It doesn't feel that flimsy. As long as you can keep uh, from them not landing like that when you hit them, should be good. Slot those into there, and then you're. Squirrel target holder fits on the top. You're supposed to just, uh, yeah, it's hard to show here. I need to do a little bit better camera here, but for what it is, I think I'm gonna make a couple legs on the bottom that I can put, stand it out, uh, say in the grass or something, something a few feet longer, just some boards drill a couple holes poke them in uh, other than that it feels really really heavy quality I mean I could see planking around that on some on it for a while with the BB guns it says it's rated up to 22 caliber even that's a pellet BB not your 22 long rifle <laughs> but uh should be fun, easy, small. Kids and I should have great time with it. I, I hope to do a little bit more on this in the future and let you all know just exactly how good it works. And I will bring some videos with the gun, playing with this hopefully here if it ever thaws out. Because right now it's been zero to 20 degrees and uh, it's not time to play with this stuff yet. So anyways, I hope you enjoy. Please like and share and uh, I'll hopefully get back soon.